that I've found parties. Um, but I am making them with a basic tilapia fish. This kind of fish you can just basically find um, in the freezer section, in your grocery store, the fresh stuff, and then the freezer section. Um, it's just a pretty cheap sort of fish, but it's good. Um, and if you're trying to watch your weight, this is a great alternative to um, a beef style taco. So basically, um, I'm just going to use the tilapia. You can grill this, um, you can marinate it and then grill it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to make the marinade and then, because I just pulled this right out of the freezer, and then I'm just going to stick this right on the stove top tonight. And, um, Let's get started. So it's basically tilapia. This is two pounds, depending on how big your family is. Um, and we're going to make the marinade first. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take, and I'll have this all um, at the end of the show on the blog because I'm kind of fast, I guess, sometimes. But fourth a cup of olive oil, and um, I just kind of eyeball this depending on. If you're really watching your weight, you don't even need the olive oil, maybe a couple tablespoons, and then add more water and more vinegar. So we're just going to add olive oil, and then a couple tablespoons of vinegar. And again, if you like more vinegar, add more vinegar. This is pretty much how you like it. There's no the cake's not going to fall if you don't put the right amount of yada 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 in it. Okay, so we have the vinegar. Um, then we're going to do um, chili powder. I'll do about two tablespoons. And add the chili powder. Um, I do about two heaping. Let's go three. Let's go three heaping. Um, I guess this is in between a teaspoon and a tablespoon. And then I'm going to add a couple, let's say that's, so that's about a heat, that's about a tablespoon. And then we're going to add some cumin, that's about a teaspoon. And then we're going to add some Old Bay seasoning. I say a heaping of that because I really like that flavor. Cayenne pepper to taste, smoked paprika, I just do a couple shots of that, and crushed red pepper flakes. And some crushed red pepper flakes, about a teaspoon of that. We're going to add some garlic, I like garlic so this is going to be a nice I need a better zester. This doesn't really work well, but um, if anyone would like to get me a zester, that would be really cool. So, okay, so that's about a teaspoon of the zest of the lime. Then I'm going to take half of that lime. I'm going to get some lime juice. So I put another batch also in uh, the oven because my son came home and it looks like we're going to have some grown boys to feed. So, um, so right now what we're going to make is um, the dressing to drizzle on top of this. We're basically going to take the fish and we're going to roll it into a tortilla shell. If you have pitas, that would be great. If you have the hard um, taco shells, that would work too. Um, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to use just 
plain old sour cream. If you have fat free sour cream, use that. If you're trying to keep things low fat. I'm going to do two um, things of sour cream tonight. I'm not sure how much because we're going to eat. Okay, so we got the sour cream. Then we're going to um, put some chipotle peppers in there. So I'm going to add two chipotle peppers. All right, we're going to just stir this dressing up, and this is what we are going to drizzle over our tilapia tacos. So basically, all we're waiting on is um, the tacos to get done. So what we're going to put on this for our garnishes, I just have some plain old cabbage that I bought at the grocery store. I'm going to transfer this into a smaller serving Okay, so we have the cabbage. Alright guys, so here is the fish. It has been marinating in the um, chipotle sauce. So I'm going to take out um, probably a piece, piece and a half, and make my husband a plate. Alright, so we're going to make one of these. We're just going to take about half of a tilapia. We're going to throw some cabbage on top. Some tomatoes in there. Maybe you want to drain these. Cheese. And you dip. And that look nummy? Basically, I'm just going to roll it just like that. Nummy. 